um, first of all, you have a formal sector health insurance that covers people within the public um, uh, sector, government officials mainly. You also have the vital um, contributory health insurance scheme that, um, although classified under the former sector, but in a way, it gives people the opportunity to purchase health insurance on their own without necessarily going through any organization. So you can, as an individual, you can go and buy health insurance. And of course, you have the private health insurance scheme that um, people can buy, but mostly organizations, private organizations, buy health plans for their staff. Then you have um, the, the vulnerable group that are also covered. Ideally, it's the government, because, and through the NHIS, because the acts establishing the NHIS is to provide health insurance to all Nigerians. The only way that an individual can approach a health insurance, a HMO to buy health insurance is through that vital scheme. And um, although it is, you can buy from uh, any of the HMOs, but in principle it's actually administered by the NHIS. So actually, when you go to access care, as far as the hospitals are concerned, you're actually under NHIS. Definitely, um, um, the, 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 set of, the set of people within the informal sector are really the ones that ideally should take advantage of this. But you see, the challenge is that how many of them actually know that um, such scheme exists? We think it's high time that the NHIS, you know, start up and ensure that you know, as many Nigerians as I can afford it, know about it and able to purchase it when they want to. NHIS, my advice to them is really to utilize every platform of communication, social media, um, print media, electronic media, going out to where these artisans are actually located to speak with them.